What's up guys, it is Halt, and we are going to do uh, whatever the campaign for the Liberator is. And I'm actually going to throw on a crew this time. I haven't been doing that. Um, hmm, recruit. Alright, let's roll. Uh, I think I want uh, the defense one. Not this one. <clears throat> I don't really don't really need the base. Well, I got to keep this as a silver, um, even though I probably won't use it. But that one would actually would have been decent. Montov maidens. <clears throat> I'm looking for uh, um, the resistance one. Let's see. Nope. Nope. No, no, <laughs> nope, pretty much I've gotten everything but what I want, so that's cool, I guess. Steelheads is what I want, but I want the, uh, the bronze one, not the common one. I think it's like common, uncommon, rare, and legendary or something like that, so I want the uncommon one. Though I do need to fill up on resources, so I could have taken that Warfrats. Oh my goodness. Of course, I thought, you know, usually this doesn't take long to roll one, but okay. Fight me, I guess. Fun stuff. Wow, I got a Silver Salty. <laughs> Honestly, I can't really be mad, but whatever. Um... This is kind of annoying. Where another freaking silver Molotov maiden. I can't even get mad. I've gotten three silvers. This is crazy. See, this is what I want, but I don't want it. I want the 15%, not the 10%. See, that's the one I want right there. Just give me it. Give me. Please. Uh, junkyard dogs. Nope. Lucky bastards. I don't think I even could get any more blueprints. There we go. Alright, so now, let's throw you on there, so where are, is it, there it is, steelhead, so 15%, and let's go, and the Garidian, uh, it might be good in this campaign, but I don't know, we'll see, uh, Homeland, let's get our third liberator, start. Oh, the greeting is really good for the 112s, so that is awesome. Um, it, it got the it got the job done. It can do what, like I said, it could do one. In, I think it said in the last video or the next video, depends. I think I'm putting this out before my base defense video, but it got the job done pretty damn fast. So the the first like bunch of levels, I kind of just like go through them and not really worry about what's going on. Uh, because, honestly, like, you don't want this video to be super long. Though I did see uh, one guy in my alliance, he had a fleet of three of these with cannons on them. And it did some murder. It just was murking everything. So there's that. Dead. And... Everything is now toasted. Now let's head over this way to take out that. So I will post it up right here, and then I'll send one out a little bit more because those are rockets. So, but yeah, his cannon fleet was like amazing. All right. Boom. And the Garidian is like, I feel like, uh, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure the Garidian is uh, a lot more accurate with the anti-missiles. Uh, because I only had one anti-missile on it, and it pretty much didn't get hit. So, that's cool. Boom. Last one. 
And honestly, I'll just leave him here, because by the time they catch up, it'll basically be in range. Alright. First round down. The first round is super easy. Like, as you can see, I probably... I might have 10 minutes damage. We'll see. And... Oh, I did take some damage on those. The final damage is... Oh, 20. Ooh. But whatever. Uh, so 1, 2, 3, and 4 are with this fleet. 5 is with my pride. 6 is with this fleet. And 7 is with the pride. Okay. I need to put some uh, armor on these still. But like like um, the charged armor M, I think I'm going to be putting on them. So that should help when I make mistakes. Alrighty. Yeah, it's funny how like little the lesion actually does. So like they kind of like they're there, but they're more of just like distract some of the damage from you for like a little bit. Alright, so they're coming in. Let's just toast the rest of this here. Alrighty. We are now officially waiting for them to show up. Because I don't really want to move right now. Here's one. There's the other. Fire. One down. Two down. Four ships to go. And this one actually coming right here. I should be able to splash uh, the ship behind it. So it's kind of like a two for one right there. And I believe. And this is it. All right. So that's round two done. And I'm still like fairly. Uh, oop, my bad. Um, I usually. You'll, you'll see basically. Um. There's better ways to do this to take less damage, but honestly, since um, I gotta get, I gotta do studying. Um, I don't really care. I just take my damage, um, so I can repair while I study. And because I obviously I can't play if my ships are down, so it's easier to find that in incentive to actually study. So for this one is, uh, see they kind of. They're kind of a distractor, so obviously I take out this here, and then usually by the time I take this out, those ones right there are all dead. So let's see if this works again. So it did in fact work, and so I don't have to worry about uh, killing those at all still, and that thing died without uh, really hitting me with anything. Um, yeah. All right. Boom, and round three is almost done. So you see, the first three rounds are pretty, st pretty stinking easy with this, and the gradients, or not the gradients, the monoliths. And that's what I have on them um, right now. It will be changing. All right. There's another one. Boom. And... Last one. 
in a second once this guy actually catches up. <clears throat> and smoked it. Alright, so now for the fourth round, which you can see I'm almost, I'm about two-thirds damaged, or I mean a third of the way damaged. So... Start combat. I should be able to do, with the, the amount of tokens I get from this, I should be able to do uh, two and a half uh, liberators instantly. Um, but I'm going to do five half raider, or, uh, liberators. So I know it sounds weird. Or maybe not. Uh, maybe not. I probably should just do the what I was saying. Uh, two and a half liberators and then finish the third. Because you would rather have a full liberator than a bunch of half liberators, technically, because then you could do better with the with the stronger ships. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. All right. Boom. Another one bites the dust. This one, this one is dead. Okay. So now I come out here and do the same thing as usual. But see, the thing is, kind of got to know which ship to move towards first. I believe it's this one. Yeah, see, this is a missile ship, so I can take this one out pretty fast without it ambushing my stuff. So that one's done. And so now I can kind of uh, not get flanked here. So these three here will close in on me. And there's one. Now I can kill these two together. And you see I'm about 50% damaged. These things are slow. Alright, so there's, these are missile ships. So, that's good for me. Those are the easier ones to kill because they don't move. Boom. So that one is done. Even though there's like still like life somewhere. So I'm assuming it's somewhere over there. But whatever, it's not my problem. That's done. So now is time for me to recall this and bring out the, the pride and the reason i am recalling it is because sometimes there are you know people in sector hitting ships so can't have that especially in the middle of the video okay so cancel that start repairing that two and a half hours on this right now wow okay um this stuff's in here just because it looks cool in there. But, but you'll see, I really don't need those. Because I can do this for instant repair with just my mostly built pride. Um, yeah. If I put Bullseye Brigade on my pride. I could make it actually do like useful things, but like in actual bases. But I'm not too interested on it. Uh, 360 medals is fine for me right now. Um, when I get my liberators, it should be even more. Oh wow! Look, there's a hole. Okay. I don't like watching this. I like things like this. Like missiles are cool, but you you don't get to see like the walls just melt and disintegrate. And it's so much cooler with the scatter guns. Scatter guns are cool. Uh, rockets are awesome as well. I remember melting walls with my rockets in the old days with the uh, threshers. Yep. And then when uh, was it the hell? can't remember what they're called actually right now. I still have some. They're the rock the Reaver rocket ships.
Yeah, yeah, there you go. So that was done. Instant repair, probably like. Let's see. I would say like maybe two seconds. Two seconds of damage. And then there's that awkward like life bar there, which I don't know what it is. Let's see. Seventeen seconds, whatever. Um. So that's repairing. Um. I don't actually have to auto repair that. And that, you know what? Yeah, I'm definitely gonna dock it. All right, let's go grab it. Repairing you. And we are actually going to throw in Gridian's monolith in this one, which means I have to put this back down here. This here. This is for when, um, if this dies. But otherwise, I'll keep that s well, not safe, but reserved. Alright, start. Alright, so, start here, drop a rocket, four, three, two, one, apparently there's still something on that, oh, I missed that one, I mean, whatever, uh, All right, so that's done. I kind of do this one in pieces, so that's the next piece, then this one, and then that one if I feel like it, and then the main attack. This is just to save some repair, so um, I might be able to do a second round if I don't screw this up again. Like I usually screw this up and like they die, these two things die. Um, and that's a lot of repair, but if I don't screw this up, then I won't have nearly as much repair, and I can actually, like, do round four today. That'll be super nice. So then I can start getting, uh, base parts to finish up, um, my base. Alright, so... Let's move it all right here. And I watch for that yellow right there, so that's good. All right, so we're gonna drop it right here. Four. Six, five, four, three, two, one. So see, that's all fine, and I don't actually shoot that down, but so that's all dead now. And I'm actually, I think I can kill this without um, triggering that, and I can. Alright, cool. Now I retru er, retreat and hit this one. And I think I'm going to try and knock this all down one. So, I'll drop one right here, go in here, blah, blah, blah. You know, you'll see what happens. So this is my Garidian right now. As the Phalanx Anti Missile One, there's four Ds because I don't have uh, the um, Gales and the Harriers on it because Harrier has the same range as some of the others. It does do less damage, but it is lighter. I, that's why it's on. <sighs> All right, so. You know, I was thinking, um, I still have what, uh, the Mastodons, since I don't have a, um, Rhino built yet, I can just use the Mastodons, even though, obviously, trust me, I know, they are not as good as the Rhinos, they won't do nearly as much damage as the Rhinos, 
However, they will still do something. And something's better than nothing. Alright, 12 seconds. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, and 4. Move in. I was able to stun everything. So... Done deal. Now let's wait. And then I'll do I only have to come in back come back in one more time and we'll be good. And boom, all right. Start. I'm actually going to come in from this side so I can kill that. And I'll pinch right here. <laughs> 12, 11, 10, 9, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, Boom. Oh, man. I just remembered. I wasn't actually going to pinch that, but whatever. It's cool. All right. Four, not the rest of that. And kind of just melt this stuff down. Alrighty, so that's good, let's kill you, and now they're bringing in all the other ships, so, like this one right here, so I can bring you around and kind of parade you, so now, actually it's cool, because this guy, once he gets here, the mortars will be dropping and they'll both die about the same time. All right. And look at the just go. Just boom 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 boom. That's just styles they're just firing like crazy. Let me bring in my gridian over here and see if I can get any assistance in. Okay, so now we just got to kill him. So this was a pretty successful run, which is awesome. And you can see the difference that uh, missile makes in range as well. Boom, done, done, done. Okay, so now I just gotta do, so I can just repair this now. Okay, go to dock, go to dock. 
So cancel. Um, so that's like a couple minutes. So uh, I didn't really need that in there that time, but you see, you see, I got close to almost needing it. All right. So let's head in. Finish up the campaign. Not not a big deal, guys. You know. Uh, Apparently, Thailand is not a word. <laughs> Sorry. I'm also playing words with friends, but, you know, it's cool. Yeah, and it's even spelled Thailand. That's lame. That's lame. Okay, so let's stop them real quick and just bring in him. The other guys, y'all can go sit over here, actually. Alright. So I'm going to start this by just, you know, just melting some of this. Just, just chilling. Alright. AdWords. I guess there's no, um, anyway. So, almost through the walls. <laughs> but you can see I'm not taking much damage. Um, Alright. Pretty exciting stuff, right, guys? Alright, whatever. I'm just going to keep moving. Pretty exciting, just just driving. This is just driving. Driving, driving, driving. Let's take out these guys. Boom. Boom. And I take out these guys. Here I can actually bring these guys, I think, in here. Oh, I missed this one right here. Gotta take that out. It's cool, though. I don't really, I'm not really worried about this damage here. Ooh, but one of them has taken a ton of damage. It's all good, though. This would all be like, I mean, obviously, if you if you use less, like, I'm just doing this because I kind of want to speed things up. But as you see, I don't actually need to take all this damage that I'm taking. Usually, I take a lot less damage with this too, so that's probably because I'm just messing around. And these should all be focusing on this, so I can just kind of drive through here. So, and actually you, finish that off. Boom, and that should be it. And there's that weird health out of nowhere. So yeah, that's the uh, campaign. It's pretty easy. There's a liberator. It's not at least not pretty easy, but it's fairly easy. Now I have total of 18, six times three, 18 days. Liberator build tokens, which is nice.
um, so I'll get free liberators. But I kind of want to wait till, as you can see, I'm doing you know whatever. Uh, kind of want to wait. I, I, you can see, yeah, you see where I am. So I got one week, two weeks, three weeks. Uh, that one, two, three. And the fourth week is when I get this, and that's kind of what I want. Explosive overlay is. Okay, but anyway, um, yeah, so that's what I'm kind of waiting for to actually do my liberators full, because I don't want to waste, you know, I don't want to waste anything. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe for more. Till then, peace off, guys.